All right. Good morning. It's April. I can't believe it. And we just finished Smart in St. Martin, which is amazing. So it was a phenomenal trade show. So if you have not attended and you're interested, Smart will definitely happen again next year. And we highly encourage you to come and not only meet with all of the partners, but be able to experience some of the island as well, because it's an immersive opportunity, an immersive trade show. So we're happy about that. So today, um, today was funny. We tried to put it together and it had all sorts of intonations and it wound up being like the best possible group. So, so we're excited. So we've always got our friend Marla from St. Martin Tourism Bureau, lovely lady that I just met, Micheline, who is run, running the coolest, coolest booth in at St. Martin Carnival. And you're going to hear all about her history. And then we have our dear friend Nancy from the beloved uh, Sinesta. So I'm excited because she's got a lot of updates for the for both hotels um, under the under the umbrella. So we're going to move right into Marla. She looks like she's got an amazing background as always. So why don't you go ahead and bring us up to speed on what's going on in the island? Hi, morning, everyone. Gabby, hi, how are you doing? I wish you were here with us in St. Martin. You know what's going on. It's our carnival. So we're here preparing, celebrating. We've had already a whole two weeks of carnival going on. I'm actually going to walk into the village, kind of give you guys a heads up of what's happening, show you a, a little bit of the scene. Now, remember, we're doing this in the morning where you can come to the actual village and have some lunch before you even have the events in the evening, the musical entertainment. And the carnival parade is actually happening on April 30th. It's a grand parade. I know you guys are gonna love whatever you see on the social media platforms. Um, this is the Justin Festival Village. And in this location, we have a number of different uh, booths that are set up. And all of these booths in the evening are lit up or even at lunchtime, you can come and grab a nice, Train. By the way, we have a surprise for you with that as well. As you know, uh, Michelina will be coming on. But just wanted to give you guys a little idea about the village looks. Um, this is uh, the basically the Just Festival Village. We have VIP area sitting. That's in the back of me. And as I get kind of in the middle of the Festival Village, you'll see all the boots that are lined around. So it's a pretty slow because tonight is a very big night, a big event that's happening, a concert. We have the stage back here. And then all around me, you have the various foods that have their different dishes. Most of them are preparing now for lunch. So I'm going to see what I can find to eat. And I think I'm heading over to Michelina. Gabby, back to you. Okay, amazing. I, I I can definitely be everybody's getting their beauty sleep because I'm sure it's going to be a massive night. So I cannot wait to see what happens. And I know last year we had a lot of fun with you were sharing videos and telling us all about what was going on in Carnival. So we look forward to that again. It's it's a it's an amazing time on the island. All right. So Micheline, I just met you like five minutes ago, but I was getting so into your story. This woman has apparently the best drinks, best snacks at Carnival and the coolest story. She has a booth called Patience, which is a a name I don't resonate with at all, but I, but I appreciate it. <laughs> and I can't wait to hear your story. So come on and uh, yeah, introduce yourself and tell us about you. Hi, good morning. My name is Micheline Warner. I am the boot holder of Boot 51 Patients. The boot is uh, actually a family. Um, it's passed on, you can say, from my mom. My mom had a carnival boot for the past, well, it was my mom's boot for the past 32 years. Um, after my mom's passing, the boot was um, turned over to me. So the last seven years, I'm trying my best to keep up what she started um, with the different foods, the different drinks, the different um, experiences that you have here at Boot 51. My boot is known for the best oyster soup, conch and dumpling, conch soup. Um, we do specialty drinks. We have child support. We have blood supply. We have Big Bird. We have the Hulk. Um, it's it's a trend that's continued going on. My mom was also known for her local punches. She did punches out of Punxeret, Star Fruit, Passion Fruit, Tamarind. So I'm just trying my best to continue that on. Tell me more about the Hulk. What's in that? Like, what? is it just okay, a surprise? So the the um, child support, that? the child support and the Hulk. I'm not too sure of all of the ingredients because it's my brother's um, put together. 
I do know the, the Hulk has Malibu in it. The child support has Grand Marnier. But every other detail, I really, really can't tell you because I don't even be around when he's mixing his concoctions. Those are the um, best kind of the... Those are the best Sorry? kind of drinks. Those are the best kind of drinks when you don't know. Yes, and you just yes. Stop. And and you you will you just so you know, they are the most um sold drinks here at the at the boot. So yes, we run out of it very fast. So what's the top dish? What usually sells out at a carnival? Like what what if somebody's coming for the first time, I'll put it that way, what should they absolutely be eating when they stop at your booth? I would say chicken leg, spare ribs, and Johnny Cake. Okay, gotta have a Johnny Cake. Coming to the carnival village, you cannot do without a traditional chicken leg and Johnny Cake or a traditional um spare rib and Johnny Cake. You you can also add potato salad that gives it a very um complimentary side but i would say that's that's the that's like going going back that's what carnival was about um you came to the village to enjoy the scenery you came to the village to enjoy other people's company the good music the good food um over the years um dishes has um re reinvented themselves we have um, came up with different new innovative dishes to try um, if you must say compete with another to see um, what sells best what our creative side has and we have a lot of other boots in the village that do have um, amazing amazing dishes I myself I I cook I sell food here daily for lunch and in the evenings but from time to time, okay, every day, let me be honest, I go to um, my sister boot on the other side of the village. That's G-Spot. They have the most delicious satays. I also go and have um, little snacks at Yaden. And I also go to um, Hot, Hot, Hot Waves. That's the name, Hot Waves. I think he moved. He moved a few um a few boots down, but through throughout the village, you will find other um other boots that sell um very nice um cuisines, very nice snacks, very nice um how you say punches and specialty drinks as well. Amazing, amazing. Well, it's such a pleasure to meet you. Make sure we we'll, thank you, we'll thank you. We'll have to get a carnival map from Marla and Mary. X marks the spot on where you are, but you are such a pleasure. And I think it's just so lovely how you're carrying your mom's legacy forward. I try my best. I try my best. That's my mom in the background. So she was a former um, traffic control officer. So she, she is, um, well, she was very known on the island. She was the life of any party. <laughs> She was the life of any party. You put her in any situation and she made the best of it. Um, I'm trying my best. I can't, I can't tell you I am doing exactly what she used to do because at that for sure I am not. I am not doing, but I'm trying my best to just continue on her legacy with carrying out everything that I do um, with the boot. That's amazing. Well, it's so good to meet you. Thank you for your spirit. Thank you and for having me. Yeah, just another one of these amazing friendly faces that you've seen come across in St. Martin Carnival or not. Thank this is you. Really, the island is just full of, of people with wonderful spirit and warm heart. So I'm glad that you all got to meet her too. And we're going to take you over to to uh, the largest hotel complex, certainly, and the most well-known, and give it over to Nancy, who's, I'm sure, got a lot of fresh updates for us from uh, Sinesta. So you can go ahead and share your screen when you're ready. Thank you, Gabby. And I have to say, Micheline and Marla, I'm so jealous I'm not there with you. I was there for SMART, but I'm back to the U.S. Meanwhile, and I'm so sad that I'm missing the big party. So um, grab one for me and enjoy, please. And uh, yeah, salute <laughs> to everybody's health there. So welcome to Senesta Resorts in Martin. My name is Nancy. And of course, what uh, other, what better slide to start with than this beautiful views here right in front of you. I hope you can see my uh, beautiful views that I'm sharing with you. Gabby, all good for the view? 
Oh, perfect. Yep. Good. Great. Okay. So yeah, once, you know, when we, when I introduce our all-inclusive resorts, not just the fact that we're all-inclusive is so unique on the island, but of course, also our location. I mean, just look at this, the beautiful, gorgeous views, the water, I always call it the 50 shades of blue right there. Uh, so our location, obviously, is one of the best selling points, I would say, of the resort. So those of you who haven't been for a while or, or, or who are not familiar yet, we are on the Dutch side of the island, as you can see on the map, right by the famous Maho Beach. So I'm sure you've all seen the pictures and the videos of uh, the location. So it's really a great spot to be. Let me see if we can get this to move. There we go. For those who were still not very sure, this should definitely ring a bell because of course, when staying with us, sitting on the beach or sipping a drink, wherever you are uh, really in the resorts, you have the gorgeous views of the Maho Beach and the Maho Bay with the planes flying in. So that's something everybody wants to experience. It never gets old really. And um, yeah, it's definitely uh, one of the best selling points of the resorts. But not just the plains and the Maho Beach, we have another great, uh, that went too fast there, we have another great beach. One of my favorites is the Mullet Bay. So I always like to share this picture as well, which shows it so well. So we're literally the Maho Beach in the front and Mullet Bay in the back. And this is literally less than 10 minutes walking from the resort. So beautiful, beautiful beach to explore. And as you know, there's 37 beaches all together around the island. So just go ahead and pick your favorite and let me know which one that is. So going to our resorts, I mentioned already, we are fully all-inclusive, something that uh, is always kind of a surprise to, uh, to many of you still. So we wanna make sure that you're really uh, aware and you have all the right tools to inform your clients to look for the best spot uh, to spend their stay and their vacation in St. Martin. So we have in the back there, the taller white building, that's our Sanesta Maho Beach Resort, Casino and Spa. This is our fun for all ages resort. So our family friendly resort. And then right next to it, to the left, we have Sanesta Ocean Point. And that's our also all inclusive adults only little gem with only 130 ocean view suites. So you can see from the way everything, everything is laid out, wherever you're really sitting and standing and enjoying everything, you, uh, you have that amazing ocean view. You're right by the beach. Everything is super walkable. It's really very small. For being an all-inclusive resort, you cannot compare it to the big setups in other destinations. So that's something I always really like to point out. Another thing that is so amazing, we're right in the Maho village. So you walk out of the lobby, you're right away part of that famous island vibe. So that's just a, a truly unique experience to be able to do that. You can just hop on the local bus and, you know, head to Phillipsburg, to Simpson Bay or anywhere else on the island. It's so easy to go about and get around when you're staying with us, but you still have your all inclusive. So that's a really nice base to have. So let's take a look at uh, Sanesta Maho Beach. So that's our family friendly resort with literally something for all ages. You will see to the left our uh, mini club. So of course we have the families with the children, we have the kids pool, we have the teenager activities and really entertainment uh, all through the day and also at night five restaurants all together to choose from and also two of our restaurants are actually in the village so again very unique you walk out you still use your all-inclusive at two of our restaurants there and of course we have some additional spots we have a really nice barbecue by the pool always and we have of course a pizza place and our maho cafe for the little grab and go so you know you never get hungry so very important i mean saint martin is a foodie island so we definitely keep up to that level as well. And across the street, we have our casino with entertainment as well. So lots and lots of things to do for everybody, something. So when we go to check out the rooms, we try to keep it very easy in regards to the different room categories. Uh, what is going to be different is really the view, depending on the height, on the level of the floor, where your room is located, and then the bedding you can really uh, reserve according to what your clients are looking for, whether it's a king size bed with a pull out couch or the two double beds, it's going to have a maximum capacity of four people in the room. And as you can see also in the middle picture, we have some connecting rooms to uh, accommodate those families that request those. 
they are not guaranteed. However, we do try to uh, to make it possible as much as uh, as much as we can, obviously, to accommodate those families. But size and decor rise, they're all going to be the same. Very spacious rooms. So here's a little view of one of the higher floors. And one of the questions we always get is, of course, how far are they from each other? The Maho and the Ocean Point, as you can see, they're right next to each other. I mentioned it. Everything is so walkable. You can have a better look here also at our kids pool in the back, the aqua slides in the kids pool, as well as for the bigger ones in the main pool as well. And right there across that pool and that little roundabout, we have our ocean point lobby. So it's a really nice walkable setting right by the ocean. And of course, for those who do need to work a little bit in resort, we can also accommodate you. We have our Meet Me in Paradise program. I want to check just that little uh, hum that you see there in the ocean in the back. Island hopping is something we always recommend, of course. You have a beautiful view on the island of Seba there. But going back to our meetings in paradise, you uh, can really set up all your groups for that program. We have our sales team in resort who can help you out with all of that. And Dream Weddings in Paradise is another program we have. What better spot to have the best uh, day in your life right there with amazing views. Uh, we usually do that outdoors. However, if uh, you require to have an indoor setup, that is also possible. We have all the spaces and the team available to set that up for you. And going quickly over to our little gems and Astortion Point, that's our adults only, as I mentioned before. This is uh, also all inclusive with 130 ocean view suites. And what we have here is really the higher luxury uh, point that your clients may be looking for with 24 hours of room service. Uh, the 25 highest uh, ranked room categories offer also uh, butler service, which is always very appreciated. Three restaurants altogether, exclusive to our Ocean Point guests. And it's really a true gem uh, with everything we can offer. It's, it's really that Zen style, that uh, luxury, relaxing um, mode that you get in once you're there. The service, the food is just amazing. It's, it's, it's really, really nice here. Here you have a little view of our swim out suites. And I just had an update this morning from our sales call where it was announced that we will actually be uh, converting the swim out pool into a saltwater pool, which is so popular now. So this is not even official yet. So this is hot of the press. <laughs> and that is something that will be happening. And we may even have some other pools uh, where we're going to do the same. So that's uh, a little breakout news there. I mentioned already we're a foodie island, so of course we have to keep up to speed. Azul being one of our most favorite uh, restaurants here at the Sonesta Ocean Point with beautiful views. A daily changing menu is really one of the greatest spots to be. And on top of Azul, we have Bluefin. Again, amazing views to dine uh, at sunset right here with some Pokeball style dishes or Portofino, the Italian, another beautiful setting right by the cliff here at the ocean. It's all very relaxing and of course, accompanied by great food. And uh, something I would like to point out always works really, really great, especially for those groups traveling together maybe some families or some groups of friends, some with a different budget or traveling with children. When staying at Ocean Point, you can also access everything on the Maho side. So you can all hang out on the Maho side, enjoy entertainment, food and drinks. And then the Ocean Point guests can just go back to their own little private area whenever they are ready for that. But that just allows for groups of friends and families to spend a nice time together there on the Maho side. So. And that is a great opportunity that is always well taken care of. And for those who haven't seen this update yet, we did an additional pool for the Sonesta Ocean Point guests, an extra pool, uh, which is the seascape, a beautiful one. It's infinity, very relaxing and quiet atmosphere right here as well. And for those of you traveling in the near future, I recommend always to download our app. Uh, just go to Senesta St. Martin, or I can send you also the QR code to download it easier. 
if that works for you. And this gives you nice insight prior to travel, to entertainment programs, also to our different dining options with the restaurant hours and so on. It just gets you all excited and ready for your upcoming trip. So definitely make sure to share that with your guests. And to thank you all for your uh, assistance, your support always to our business. We have joined um, quite a while ago now uh, our program, our Agent Rewards uh, Travel Bonus Program. So definitely uh, make sure to sign up at mymaho.rewards.com. It's under the umbrella of my booking rewards and you will get rewarded uh, in cash for your minimum five night qualifying reservations at either Sonesta Maho or Sonesta Ocean Point. So that's really our way to say thank you and that we appreciate your business and also uh, for us to work together really, really well and even more in the near future. And that kind of brings us to the end of this little uh, presentation. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. Uh, if you would like a more one-on-one, -on -one, more personalized, if you have any additional doubts, always reach out to me. I'm always available for you. And I'm hoping that at least this uh, little presentation was very helpful to you. Presentation was great. Thank you so much for doing that. I appreciate it. So, you know, if you have nothing else to do this weekend, uh, fly down to St. Martin, <laughs> go stay <laughs> at Sinesta and check out the carnival facilities. Um, but otherwise, it's a great place to, to think about going for next year, too. And year round, Sinesta is one of your, your top partners on island. Oh, I see a toast happening. Hold on. A Come on. Happening. What are we having here, Michelle? This is the child support drink. We're having child support drink. And all of those who need it, <laughs> cheers! Happy I love, I love, I love my job. This is like really, really fun. <laughs> and guys, you can stay at Sinesta. They have great prizes usually for the carnival. So cheers, and see you in Saint Martin soon. Cheers to all of you. Thank you. What a great group, and all, I just I love seeing all of you. So have a wonderful time this weekend, and we'll we'll check all of you back next month when we're here for our next sales call. Thank you so much, and you guys, you ladies, keep it easy, and I, you know, don't do anything I wouldn't do. So <laughs> have a great time. Thanks, Nancy, too. We really appreciate it. Thank you, you everybody. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Nancy, <laughs>